got to have a change of scene Cause every night I had the strangest dream Prison by the way it could have been Left here on my own or so it seems Got to leave before I start to scream Someone's locked the door and took the key I'm feeling all right Not feeling too good myself how we're kicking it off today on this Friday because we are feeling all right. What's up Hall of Famers? Card Shop Eric here back live at Hall of Fame Baseball Cards Arcadia California kicking off episode number 11 of this Personal Breaks series on Friday nights. What's up? Hope everyone's doing well. We'd like to see some people jumping in to some personal break items tonight. Any of the group breaks that we have set up. Box wars or pack wars, whatever. You guys know the drill. Mm, link in the group chat right there. Yeah, all right, all right, all right. Hope Fletcher was on and heard that song. That song was for you, for you Brandon, if you're, if you're already on with us. Hope, hope you are. Um, but yeah. We're going to have a little fun this evening. It's Friday night, folks, and uh, let's get right into it. Why not? Prize wheel spins for the Bracken. Let's release the Bracken right now on the prize wheel. What's up, everybody in the group chat? I see some familiars popping in. Hope you're all doing well. Starting off with 2019 Archive Sigs Retired. 2019 Archive Sigs Retired. That's the orange box for the Bracken. Three, two, one, don't blink. Well, Brad Osmus, 19 of 38 on an old school stadium club buyback right there. Very colorful card. That is 1994 Stadium Club. Brad Osmus. <clears throat> and Matt's got a second prize wheel spin coming up right now. By the way, that opening song was from Joe Cocker. Feeling all right. And then we got 12 packs of Donruss right here for the Bracken as well. So we're going to be checking out a few Donruss packs here, see if there's any hits lingering in here. All righty. Just going to try to kind of flip through, see if there's anything interesting lingering in these packs. Oh, little Jonathan Davis there. What's up, Mondragon? Happy Friday to you. Mm -mm -mm. There's a little Mike Trout out of 349 right there. After this, we got Bill B. River P is in the lineup. Uh, Linda G is in the lineup. Adam C. Jose. Tori. And we got a few pack wars lined up as well. But we'd love to get some more items in the lineup. If that link posts, it'll post in about 10 seconds. Let's see if it works. Now, did it post? No. <laughs> Give it some time. What do you mean? I don't know. 
in five minutes. A little Dominators, Jose. I've seen a bunch of Jose Ramirez come out of this 12-pack lot so far. Ah, cool. Nice. Find our personal break items here. The, the little night bot. Sick. I was only able to set it to go uh, every five minutes. That's as, that's as fast as it will... Oh, look at that. Nightbot does a little stop spamming thing. Is that what it is? Mm -hmm. That's cool. So we set up Nightbot to help moderate our channel a little more automatically. So any... <clears throat> Watch out for the Nightbot, folks. You thought I was scary. <laughs> yeah. Well, so what did... What did he do? I guess he... I'm not sure what he did. We, we might have to make some adjustments on the Nightbot. Look at that. 12 packs, no major hits in there. For Donruss, for Matt B. But Matt B, thanks for kicking us off this evening. Appreciate you as usual. We're going to do a little pack war here. Matt B versus Brian J, rated rookie. Bowman pack war, high card takes all. Yeah. I can do that uh, in a moment as soon as I slow my roll here. I can do a little editing. Nothing crazy in that pack. High cards. There's a couple 129s right there. And that's going to be the highest number in the pack on the Hunter Bishop. 129 for Matt B. Let's see what Brian J comes up with. See, ooh, a little autograph of Thomas Dillard in this pack, so that's at stake in this pack war. Nothing else crazy. He's got to beat 129 to keep it. Ooh, 106. 99, no, but nothing higher than 129, making Matt B the pack war winner, winning all the cards from both packs of Bowman. Congrats, Matt. Scooby-Doo-Doo. Scooby-Doo. Now we're going to do mix in a little personal break. couple of jumbo packs for Bilby. Bilby Baggins here. Fruit. Sure, I know a Baggins. Frodo Baggins. <laughs> Let's see what's up. Oh, Victor, Victor Mesa. A little purple paper out of 250. Short ribs. Anderson, Encarnacion, Allen, and Astudio on the chrome in that first pack. Second pack. If the select case break is sold out, we will schedule a day and time to do that. Uh, but it probably won't be able to happen until earlier than, at this point, Tuesday. Probably be Tuesday afternoon next week. But thanks to whoever jumped into that to help that sell out. Consider jumping into... Uh, uh, we have a brand new Panini Noir basketball draft break of one box just to see how it goes. Nothing much big in either one of those packs for Bill B. By the way. But thank you to Bill, of course, for helping us kick it off. But yeah, we got a Panini Noir basketball break. Uh, so consider jumping into that. It's only one box. We just need eight spots to fill. And it's the hottest new basketball product on the market right now. I'm talking to people like Tang or D Thieves or uh, a couple other people that I know off the top of my head might collect basketball through us. Consider jumping into that. Also, the definitive... Uh, Brandon's going to get into the Noir break. Uh, the definitive draft break could use some spots too. Um, we would love to do that. And the Flawless Baseball Briefcase Break 
If any one of those were to sell out during the stream tonight, we can do those during the stream because they're small enough that we'll be able to do that. So consider jumping into any one of those. Mix in another pack war, Matthew D versus Matt B on Bowman. Here we go. Matthew D's pack. Little Jason Domingo spanning the globe in there. High cards, 77, 142. 142 is the high card in that pack on the Casey Mize. Let's see what Matt B has. Got to be 142. Coming up with, looks like high card is 133, so that's not going to do it for Matt B. Matthew D wins that pack war, all the cards in both packs, including that Jason Dominguez insert right there as well. Matthew D over Matthew B. And I'm going to real quick knock out this other pack war here. Marlene B versus Fabian O. Start with Marlene's pack. I'm Charlene. Hello, Charlene. I'm Marlene. Chew your gum. Let's see if anything's lingering. Let's look for high cards for Marlene. I got a 96. Got a 117 in there, which is the high card. 117. On Joe Ryan. Let's see what Fabian's got in his pack. Oh, Mount Castle in there. Fabian's got to beat 117 to take both packs. Ooh, no. High card is 103, so that's not happening for Fabian. Marlene B. wins that pack war. Congrats, Marlene. Marlene over Fabian. And now we're getting into River P's box, followed by a jersey for Linda G, followed by a couple boxes for Adam C., Followed by a prize wheel for Jose, a pack for Tori, a box for George M. And that's all we got in the lineup right now. <clears throat> I'm going to drop the link again right now a couple times. If you guys want to jump in, we'd love to rip for you tonight. Click those links in the group chat. And visit our website and see what we have to offer for personal breaks, prize wheel spins, box wars, pack wars. And group breaks. All right. River Phoenix, the Cobra. Let's check out a box of Bowman Hobby. <clears throat> right off the bat, a little Riley Green atomic refractor out of 150. So that's kind of a good start, if you ask me. There we go, nice little atomic there. A little Dustin May chrome right behind it. Ian Anderson and Nick Allen on the chrome as well in that pack. Helio Ramos, Encarnacion, and Wilfred Astudio on the chrome in that pack. Uh, Yama, will you double check the stock on gold label, please? Especially the, the regular product. Herman might be looking to get something. Bo Bichette rookie in that pack. Eric Pardino on the chrome. Cal Mitchell and Riley Green as well on the chrome there.
Oh, there's a little Jason Dominguez paper base. Right into a, t a penny sleeve for you. There you go. A little J Dominguez. J Dom. Wander Franco on the chrome. That's cool. Ashby and Ronaldo Hernandez on the chrome there, followed by Gavin Lux and Jordan Alvarez. Another Wander Franco there, number one Bowman top 100. Tim Kate and Cody Hess as well. Dylan Carlson there, Dustin May, another little atomic refractor of Casey Mize. That's pretty good. Top draft pick, Casey Mize. Atomic. Kopech on the chrome. Kalanick and Damon Jones as well. Bets. We got uh, Aquino, rookie favorites. That's pretty decent. Uh, Kirilov and Garcia on the chrome there. Little Bryce Harper paper out of four ninety nine. Uh, Campusano and Glen Allen Hill Jr. on the chrome. Ryan Barucki, of course. Short ribs and Libra Torre there. Fletch, did you hear the song at the top of the video? I don't know if you were in yet, but I did it right at the top. Hopefully you heard it. Here's Brady Singer and Ryan Mountcastle. Yeah, man, you got it. Luis Robert. Well, Dunning and Daz. Hey, Daz, give me a light. Still looking for the auto out of this box. Will it be in this pack? I think it might. I don't know why. Maybe I'm wrong. Mm. I'm wrong. I don't know why I thought it would be. Wander Franco spanning the globe. That's decent. Mateo and Garcia on the chrome in that pack. Spanning. Brandon McKay. Hullsizer and Kraus. Don't forget to check out any of our pre-sale items on our website as well. We got a half a dozen or eight uh, pre-sale items available. If you want to pre, if you want to pre-order any items before they release and the price goes up, you might want to consider some pre-orders. And I'll also give you an idea of some of the products coming down the pipeline in the next three or four weeks. So be sure to check out the pre-sale section of hofbc.com. If you're interested in that, there's a Florial and a Levine Chrome. Let's 
Spencer Howard, Baez, Demerit. You got something gold here behind a Howard. It is Franklin Perez, 7 of 75. Gold refractor. Four packs left. I don't believe we've seen the autograph yet. Buried deep in the box. Justin Dunn, Chrome, Luis Robert, and Aramis Adaman. Giggity soup, is that why you were laughing? <laughs> uh, Taylor Trammell there. Manoa and Austin Beck. Langoliers and Seth Cold Beer. There you go, Mondragon. Sip up. Is it really in the last pack? It can't be. Is it in the last pack or did I skip it? I was going, I was moving through this box for sure. There it is. Last pack. Speckle on card autograph. Harar Encarnacion out of $2.99. Last pack speckle there. A little last pack mojo. Hurrar. Hurrar! Christian Pash and Evan White on the chrome as well in those packs. So there you go. Just the ones that I put aside. Obviously not too bad. You got some nice uh, color, some inserts, some parallels. A couple nice rookies. Jason Dominguez, not a, not a bad box there, River. Thanks, buddy. Loving the new Bowman this year, guys. It looks super clean. Good stuff. Um, let's do... By the way, on the raffle block for tonight, we got a, a jumbo box of 2019 update. And a couple of quick rips right here. This is our raffle raffle items for tonight. A couple of quick rips and a jumbo box. So if you want to be in the raffle, you get a spot as usual for every $50 you spend with us tonight on personal break items. Uh, up next is Linda G with a jersey. Here we go. One of the Leaf Gold Pizza Boxes. And a quick shout out to Rennie Perez. What's up, Rennie? A little something to tip hat. First one of the night. Thanks for using the super chat feature. Says, what up, shop? How many spots left in Flawless? That's a question for Yama. I'm going to pass that one to him and see if he gets back to me. Oh, Brandon already knows. He says 15 spots left. 15 spots left if you want to see that Flawless briefcase go down tonight, folks. Meanwhile, we're going to check out a jersey for Linda G., I might open it back here just because it kind of gives away the names. All right. Hold that. Who is number 21? Who is number 21 on the Dodgers? I'll give you that hint. Does anybody know? 21 on the Dodgers. I'm going to unfold it. These things come, how about this guy right here? Jesse P got it. Bueller, Bueller, Bueller. Yeah, that's a clean jersey. Number 21 on the front there. And let's check out the auto. Boom, right there. One of my favorite signatures in the league right now is Walker Bueller. I wish it would show up on camera. That's all right. There we go. Right there on the two. Nice, clean sig. Jesse P says Vanderbilt alumni. Nice, clean jersey. Beautiful Beckett authenticated autograph. Very nice. Linda G coming up with some Walker Bueller. Hot young pitcher. Thank you. 
Thank you, Linda G. That's a good jersey right there. I'm a little jealous of that jersey. Not of the jersey itself, but the person who it's going to. Uh, Adam C. coming up now. Inception and a clearly authentic quick rip. Let's do that one first. All right, Adam, do not blink in three, two, one. Little D Rod. Derek Rodriguez, purple, four out of ten. Purple, four out of ten right there. That's pretty cool. I kind of like the way those colors clash. Not sure why. Well, that's cool. Giants fans might like that, that card. You can always use our Facebook trading group to trade amongst people in our community if you don't like what you get ripped. Adam C. with a little inception. Brandon uses the trading group. By the way, Brandon is uh, one of our resident Giants fans. All right, here, Adam, uh, Blake Snell, Trevor Story, Josh Stalmont, and Cody Bellinger at the top of the pack. You also got LeMayhew and Acuna at a 150. And before I reveal the autograph, just a quick shout out to Oliver Two Fly for a little $24.99 into the Super Chat. Appreciate your use of the Super Chat. I thank you so much. Oliver says, love the streams. Keep them up. You're helping me stay somewhat entertained during quarantine. Well, I'm glad we can help you stay somewhat entertained, if not fully entertained. <laughs> That's a joke, of course, but glad, glad you're enjoying what we do here. Family biz business since 1981, and we're just trying to bring a little love to the community as best we can. But thanks for the super chat, and hope you have a great day. Adam, here's your autograph. Michael Brousseau, out of 99, on-card rookie. What's up, Richard Martinez? Cobra says he made a trade in our trading group with Lampson a few weeks ago. I don't remember seeing Lampson. I think he, we ripped a product for him the other night, but I didn't even notice it was him. I, was, I, was, I don't know what happened. Just wasn't thinking or whatever, but... <clears throat> What's up, James M? Or James L? I was thinking about James M. We haven't seen James M for uh, over a week now, which is strange. He's usually in here pretty frequently. Hope everything's all right with him. Let me just check the lineup here. We got Jose, Tori, George, uh, Felix, uh, Aaron P is in the lineup. Uh, Fabian and Clay are also in the lineup at this time. Anybody else want to get in the lineup? Use the link in the group chat. We'd love to rip for you. We need pack wars. Two Chrome Jumbo, two Bowman Draft, and one Bowman Pack War. If anybody is interested in those, those will fill up right now. Meanwhile, prize will for Jose. up with another Archive 6 Retired Quick Rip. <laughs> Funny how that works, right? Alright, Jose. Do not blink in three, two, one. Little oh, Charles Nagy. 13 out of 17 right there. I used to have a friend. Well, he's still a friend of mine. We just don't talk as much as we used to. His last name was Nagby. Used to have all sorts of nicknames. Naggles, Nagglesby, Naggy, Nagmi, Nagless. <laughs> 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 oh, 
Uh, I missed that guy. He's down in Riverside. Actually, Brandon, that was my buddy I was telling you about when we drove to Riverside that day. Thanks, Jose. Up now is Tori D. And uh, possibly Bennett. Little jumbo HTA pack. Let's see what you got here, Tori, Gonsolin, Chang, Tim Anderson, Cool Wit, Yelly, three seconds for Bubble Pug, two, one. Loriano, Yastrzemski. By the way, Tessa, I like that little edit that you shared on my birthday. That really made me chuckle. Thanks for that. That was fun. There's a Wander Franco in this pack. That's cool. Miguel Amaya, Dalbeck, Seth Cold Beer for Mondragon. There you go. Sip away. Sip away at the beer. Pardino, Joey Bart. You got Chrome Tavares. Uh, ooh, Chrome Jason Dominguez. All right, all right. Pausing, sleeving. There we go. That's good in a single pack there for Tori. I'm going to sleeve up this Wander as well. See what else is lingering. Belazovic, Levine, Adaman, Muncie, Chapman, Kikuchi, Castillo, Alberto, Soroka, and Garcia. One hell of a model American. There you go. A couple nice cards that I just happened to put aside there from that pack for Tori D. Not a bad pack, Tori. Congrats. Ace Ventura Pet Detective, you got it right. All right, George M. Get, jumping on a hobby box of Bowman. What's up, George? We crushed all of those brews that you sent, so at your convenience, at your leisure, feel free to send more. Looking forward to your next homebrew batch. <clears throat> All right, George. Going to brew a new batch of Hanging with Shop tomorrow. That's what I'm talking about. George, George named a beer after me. That's like the coolest, highest level of respect in my world. <laughs> Here's a nice Aquino rookie out of the first pack for George. Daniel Lynch, Bryson Stott on the chrome in that pack as well. What's up, Larry K? A little Talent Pipeline, Cavaco, and Gilbert on the chrome there. Kirsch, Tristan Lutz, and Jackson Rutledge on the chrome in that pack. Little Angels Talent Pipeline featuring Joe Adele there. That's a nice card. Uh, Ronnie Mauricio and Grant Little as well. I'm feeling all right. <laughs> Mondragon, I'm sure we can make that happen. We would have done it with the first batch, Mike, but uh, apparently the brewer drank it all <laughs> before he delivered it to us. But that's, of course, brewer's prerogative. Kind of like Bobby Brown sang. Nolan Gorman there, and Tristan Casas on the chrome. Don't get high on your own supply, and don't get drunk on your own funk. Does that work? I don't know. It rhymes. 
Montero and Diaz on the chrome in that pack. Fletcher, break spots left. Noir, six spots left. 15 left in flawless and seven spots left in definitive. That's huge, Brandon. Thank you. Here's a nice Pete Alonzo. I would too, Mondragon. I would too. Uh, Travis Demerit out of four ninety nine on the paper. Uh, Mendoza and Forrest Whitley on the Chrome there. Jordan and Gavin Lux back to back once again. I'll let Mondragon answer that question, Aaron Petty. Mondragon, what do you like for West Coast IPA? That Hello IPA that George sent was really good. There's a ton. <laughs> Felix says, that moment you have to go back to work right before you're next on the breaks. Here's a Bo Bichette rookie. Well, good thing, Felix, is he can always come back and watch uh, after the fact. Yeah, Space Dust is pretty good. In the words of Samuel Jackson... It'll get you drunk. <laughs> Oliver, no, that's not the way it works. I'm sorry. Any personal breaks have to be ordered through our website at the link that Soup's going to drop right now. Here's a Luis Gill paper out of $4.99. Thank you, Sue. Bryce Wilson. Julio Rodriguez and Gus Varlin there on the chrome. Joe Adele on the Chrome. Julio Rodriguez at a four ninety nine. If Oliver, if you were hoping you could, then it wasn't a joke. That would that would make it a serious question. <laughs> Not a joke. Yeah. Just just so you now know the difference between the two. Just so you know. And that's no problem. Nothing wrong with a question like that. I used to have a boss that said, and I don't know if this was right or not, it seems okay to me, but he used to say, it's better to ask a stupid question than to not ask the question and end up making a stupid mistake because you didn't ask the question. So in that case, you wouldn't want to put up $120 on a super chat expecting to get something ripped for it and then not. So, glad you asked. Here's a Joey Bart and Scooball on the Chrome, Screwball. Jesus Lusardo, Tyler Freeman, and Jaron Duran. Yeah, you never want to, here's just another good rule of thumb, kids. You never want to give someone money automatically without knowing what you're going to get back. Never do that anywhere. Logan Davidson, D Jaseel De La Cruz on the chrome there. And never assume anything. Oh, ooh, nice little Miguel Vargas orange autograph out of 25. There you go, George, a little Dodger. 
A Dodger for Dodger for George M. And while you're checking out this, George, I'm going to shout out James L. A little something in the tip hat, a little 999. Thank you, James. He says, cheers, shop. Drinking a few brews for you tonight. Right on, James. What do you have on tap this evening? It's a nice orange parallel for uh, J uh, for George M., by the way. Oh, that's backed by a little Jason Dominguez paper. So not a bad pack. Imagine if you would have gotten that single pack right there. That's pretty good. <clears throat> Little Yingling Gold, nothing fancy. Jordan Groshans, Freudus Nova. Well, it doesn't have to be fancy to uh, drink a beer for me, that's for sure. I just appreciate the thought and appreciate the super chat. Varela. We got Hayes and Perez on the chrome. Two packs left in the box for George. And we move on to Felix. Volazovic. Blake Rutherford and Joe Ryan. DJ Braddock's got Crown Royal Apple on tap. Oh, DJ Braddock, good night, buddy. Good luck with that. Nick Madrigal, Everson Pereira on the chrome in the last pack for George M. But pretty decent box there, George, as well. I love this Vargas right there. 8 of 25. Dominguez, Adele, Rodriguez out of 499. Couple papers. Got a Bo Bichette. Talent Pipeline and Aquino right there. Not a bad box. Aaron Petty sipping on some Jefferson's Ocean. Cool. I got to do... I'm going to do this box. I'm going to do this break for Felix first because uh, I think he was, he was still waiting. So let's do that. Felix, jersey and a tier one. Let's do your tier one real quick. Looks like you're still on the chat for right now. So let's see if we can knock these out before you got to go back to work. Check out your tier one pack. Tier one pack has Anthony Rizzo, 63 out of 70. It's a nice on-card autograph. You got Kyle Schwarber out of 399. All three Cubs? No. Colby Allard, Brave, out of 250 as well. Quick sleeves on these guys. Couple nice autos though. Rizzo and Allard. Couple nice young players there. And let's check out your jersey. Here we go. Felix with a little gold pizza box. I'm going to open it back here on my lap again so I can try to. All right, who wore number 14 on a little, little dark blue and gray? Number 14, I believe he's a Hall of Famer. I'll give you a hint, it uh, looks like a Detroit Tigers jersey. Anybody know before I show the close-up of the autograph? Anybody know? How about Jim Bunning? This is a great jersey right here. I love the uh, pinstripes around the neck and around the sleeves. And then Detroit, what? Right on the front. Jim Bunning right here. 
That's sick. That's a beautiful jersey. Check out the autograph close up if I can. There it is. Good stuff. So there you go, Felix. There's Jim Bunning. See what I, see what I say about the the front of this jersey close up. That Detroit looks pretty sweet. These are hard to show off, but that Detroit looks pretty sick. Very nice jersey. You mind, uh, Sue? Oh, yeah. Thanks, buddy. Here's the sticker for that. Thank you, Felix. Hope that was uh, good enough for you to get back to work now. Hope you're excited about that. I think it's some stuff to be excited about. So thanks for jumping in tonight, and good luck in the raffle later on. By the way, tonight's raffle includes a jumbo box of tops and a couple of quick rips. So three items in the raffle tonight. You'll get a spot in the raffle for every $50 you spend with us this evening on personal break items. There you go. What's up, Styles? Styles in here. Um, ba bum bum D Thieves? Is that who this is? Is this D Thieves? No, no, it's not Thieves. No? Dustin F. Another DF. So Dustin F. Uh, set up this mystery signed baseball for Easton. Happy 10th birthday to Easton. Uh, this mystery signed baseball is from Dustin F. And we're going to open it for you right now while you watch. Everybody say happy birthday to Easton in the group chat right now if you don't if you don't mind. Easton like the baseball bat company. All right, we're going to take a look at the autograph as the happy birthdays flood into the group chat. We're going to take a look at this auto. 1985 Triple Crown winner. Ooh. Who is that? I don't recognize it, and I'm horrible with stat. Oh, it's the same one of the same guys we pulled the other night. I do recognize it now. 86 World Series champ, 84 Rookie of the Year. How about the man, the myth, the legend, the Doc, Dwight Gooden? Boom. Dwight Gooden, which he signs it Doc Gooden, which was his nickname for any of you that might may or may not know, but uh, well, crazy. great pitcher. This was signed Dwight. The other one was signed uh, Doc. No, this is signed Doc. Oh yeah. Yeah. Oh, well, the, the, oh the, the sticker. Label. I mean, yeah. The label was no, that definitely looks like it says Doc right there. D O C oh, yeah. clearly. But yeah, the stick, the last sticker said Doc. Said, huh? yeah. yeah, I think you're right. But that's great. Three inscriptions on that ball from uh, one of the best pitchers ever right there. So happy birthday once again to Easton from Dustin F. And thank you, Dustin. Cheers. Hope you guys are having a great day. Good way to celebrate. And we're going to mix in a quick pack war right now. Larry K versus Linda G on the 2020 Bowman. Let's do it. Larry's pack. Jordan Alvarez, rookie in there. Josiah Gray, Nick Lodolo. High cards for Larry include 119, 147. 147 right here on willwilson.com. Dot com, excuse me. Linda G's got to beat 147 to win it. Wander Franco, Chrome, and Vargas as well. Vargas. <laughs> that was from the Bizarro Seinfeld Bizarro episode. I uh, got to beat 147. There's a 131 there. But that is all. That's as high as it gets there for Linda G, making Larry K the winner of that pack war. Congrats, Larry.
And now we come back to a mystery ball for Aaron P. Aaron P. Aaron P. What's up? Whatever happened to Richard P? Yeah, ma. He moved up north, remember? All right, Aaron P., let's see what you got in here. Who is this? We know this guy. On a Hall of Fame baseball, he is a Hall of Famer, one of the best pitchers that ever played the game right here. Juan Marichal right there. Juan Marichal, classic. Beckett authenticated. Where is it? There it is. There's the Beckett sticker. On the Hall of Fame logo ball, signed it right underneath the Hall of Fame logo. That makes a nice little uh, display piece right there. There you go, Aaron P. Nice stuff. Can't go wrong. Uh, da, da, da. Fabian, followed by Clay, followed by Juan. Richard M. has a jersey, and Herman's rocking some gold label all the way from Norway. Well, we're going to start with Fabian. KB on the front. Ooh, autograph Tariq Screwball, as I'm going to start calling him now, out of $4.99. One pack, one auto is not a bad thing. Tariq Screwball, I wonder if he has a screwball. Nate Pearson there. Nick Madrigal. Gray Rod. Terang, Nova, Paredes, Manoa, Gorman, Kellenick. You've got Zach Brown, Chrome, Swaggerty, Blade, Little, and Casas. Savale, Dustin May, Grisham, Escobar, Votto, Castro, and Torres. Not a bad pack that included an autograph. Screwball. Thank you, Fabian. Uh, bah, bah, bah. Clay, I believe, is up. Clay, Richard, and Herman. And that's the current lineup. Uh, if you made any orders right now at this point, we'd probably be getting to you in the next 15 to 20 minutes. So consider jumping into personal break items tonight. Or group breaks. If any one of those three, the flawless, the definitive, or the noir fill out, those can happen during the stream here. The select case break will happen most likely on Tuesday. That's our next available time to do a standalone video. All right, Clay, where are you at? Toro, Abreu, LeMahieu, Lynn, and a little tricolor prism of Yachty in the first pack. We got a little Brendan McKay here. Hold on, I'm... Getting too far ahead of myself. I'm just going to show off this as well. Looks like Gavin Lux Jumbo Swatch as well. And my fingers got a little tongue-tied there. That doesn't make sense. He said fingers when he was talking about his tongue. And This is being a pain right here. It's not wanting to go into a proper sleeve, so I'll put it into the Jumbo sleeve there. I actually like this card a little more. 
Brendan McKay, a little red parallel rook. This pack, we're looking at Justin Verlander on the blue. And a little Manny Machado. Little autographed relic, tricolor. Forty-three out of forty-nine. Machado. Machado about nothing. <laughs> Another hit here. Nice Bo Bichette in there as well. And uh, Dustin May. So both of your jumbo relics were both Dodgers. Dustin May and then Gavin Lux before that. Clay, I'm pretty sure, is a Mets fan, if I remember correctly. Behind Sin Su Chu is Lewis Thorpe. That's like the third one of those autographs that we've seen in the last two nights. So it looks like Lewis Thorpe is going to be haunting select this year for us. But hopefully that'll change as uh, more people jump into some select boxes. Freeman, Brock Burke, and Domingo Leba. Domingo Leba. <sighs> Mike Moustakis on the tricolor. Well, Clay, now you got one to trade, I suppose. There's a Bo Bichette base rookie. Eloy Chapman. Four packs left in the box. There's a little Alonzo base, Dylan Carlson, and Danny Mendick. Kyle Seeger, Silver Prism. Uh, you got a little Tyrone Taylor, green. I like the green ones, they look really cool. This is numbered uh, 65 of 99. Last pack, low, Keuchel, Judge, a little Castro, and a little Royce Lewis, a little Phenom's die cut in the last pack. That's a cool card. Not numbered, but definitely cool. And we'll put that in the stack with all your your parallels there that I sleeved up. And then your three hits. Thorpe. May. Machado. And Lux. Thank you, Clay. Not too shabby.
One F on a jumbo pack of Bowman. Luis Robert, Nola, Cease, Arenado, Kane. You got Talent Pipeline Giants, Gus Varland, and Shane Baz on some chrome. Robert, Mount Castle in there, Mauricio, uh, CJ Abrams on the chrome in the middle, Cruz, Apostle, Pereira. And Rutledge, a Rosarena, Jordan, and let me guess, Gavin Lux rookie behind it. Yep. Yamamoto, Otani, Jolito, and Urena. There you go, Juan. Some nice rookies in there. And thank you. Uh, now we're going to rip a jersey for Martinez. Richard Martinez. I'm looking for Monrovia 22. Followed by Herman, followed by Brian H. with a quick rip. Select is on Tuesday. Yeah, select will probably be happening on Tuesday. All right, gold pizza box for Richard. I bet you... I Bet you he has one of these jerseys already. I don't know. <clears throat> Number 29 with a little red, white, and blue jersey. I'm going to say dark blue and a little dark red. Who do you guys think it is? Just from the uh, jersey number. Any guesses? It's not Carew. Good guess, though. <laughs> that was a good guess. Was he number 29? He must have been. I think so. Not too many people guessing, so I'm just going to show it off. Three-headed monster. All right. These things are just tough to deal with with all these cameras around. How about John Smoltz there? John Smoltz. Do you have any John Smoltz jerseys yet, Richard? This one says Atlanta on the front. Some nice pinstripes down the front and on the sleeves. There's the autograph on the number nine there. Smoltzy. Front of the jersey, Atlanta. Right there. Nice looking jersey. Hopefully that'll fit into your collection. Probably fold better than I. And here's the sticker for that box. Thanks, Richard. He does not. Oh, he has Maddox. All right. Smoltz. Now you got. He needs Glavin. Now you got. Yeah. Now you need Glavin, for sure. I know John's not on there. Who were you gonna say? John's not on there. Oh no. <laughs> <laughs> Herman. Herman's getting ripped right now. All the way in Norway. Good morning. Thanks, Herman, for staying up with us. It's probably, what, 3.04 in the morning, I'm guessing? On Saturday? <laughs> All right, Herman, let's see what's up. 2.05, okay, so then you are... Nine hours ahead. Yeah. All right. Herman likes the Cubs. Let's see if we can get any cool Cubs cards out of this box. Freeman there, Nolan Ryan. Thanks to Richard, by the way, if I forgot to say thank you. He needs more room in his man cave for more jerseys. I'm sure you can find some room. Where there's a will, there's a way. There's a nice Tatis rookie there for Herman. Turner. You know, Keston Hero rookie and a little Trey Turner, 7 out of 50. And the Class 2 red parallel.
DeGrom, you got Lindor and Bregman on the black parallels there. I don't think I've seen one Cub yet. Oh, there we go. Chris Bryant on a Class 1 base. Blackman, center guard, little JT Real Muto, Trevor Story. Here's the gold framed autograph pack. And a Pete Alonzo on the front. That's not, not terrible. Charlie Blackman on the back. And your auto. It's going to be a twin. Tortuga Williams Astudio. On card rookie. By the way, Herman, uh, in one of your packages that we've we've already mailed out, eh, one of those has a little bonus that you might enjoy. So you can look forward to that whenever they show up. Hopefully, they should be on the way at some point. I'm sure they're somewhere between here and Norway, <laughs> the Baltic Sea, somewhere, or the English Channel. But thanks to Herman for staying up with us all the way in Norway. Talk, Herman. Talk and skull. And then we got this mosaic quick rip, and then we got absolutely nothing to rip after this, folks. We got nothing to rip, and it's only 508. So this is for Brian H. Mark Cannon, Bogdanovich, Jones, Gordon, John Wall, Dylan Windler, Shaq, and Nicholas Claxton in that pack. No soda pops or nothing really. Crazy. We've usually seen soda pops in most of those, those uh, that's a fast break pack, right? Yeah. But there you go, Brian H. I like the Shaq card if I had to pick one out of there for myself. But thanks for jumping in. Another couple quick ones for James L., including a Plinko drop, variant number two. Let's get on that, James. First Plinko drop of the night. Let's roll the dice. Sixer. So you're going to be dropped into spot six. Variant number two. Let's see what's up. Three, two, one. Right down into the middle there, we've got the tech variant. What's on that tech variant, Yama? Two packs of tech. Two packs of high tech? Wonderful. Two packs of high tech right there. The highest of tech. All right. Glaber. Jansen, Ripken, Smoltz, Cole, and Hideki Matsui, 47 out of 50 in that pack. There you go. Next pack. Ortiz, Altuve, Nolan Ryan, Rosario, Rosario two times, and 
DJ Stewart on card rookie auto. Well, you know, Matsui out of 50 was cool. DJ Stewart, I'm not as familiar with. But there you go. Thanks, James L., for the Plinko drops. Let's uh, open that Bowman pack for you as well. Paper. I'm actually going to take the chrome and I'm going to set them there. Try this a little differently in this pack here. So here we go. Paper cards first. I'm just going to kind of squeeze through them here. Bo Bichette, nice. Harper. There's the paper and the chrome. You got Hull Sizer, Florial, Robert, nice. Seth Cold Beer, Mondragon, you know what to do, or anybody else with some suds. Take a sip for Seth Cold Beer. Davis, uh, Kyle Lewis. Oh, Joe Ryan autograph. Jordan Belazovic and Corbin Carroll as well in that pack. But you got an auto. Joseph Ryan. There you go. James L. Thanks, my man. Do a little Bowman pack war here. Matthew D. versus Chad M. Chad also jumped on a mystery ball. Let's we'll start with Matthew's pack war pack. High card takes all. There's a nice Bo Bichette rookie there. Dustin May rookie. Matthews high card. 124 is the highest one. 124 there on Nate Pearson is the highest card number in Matthews pack. Let's see what Chad M. Is Chad M. in the chat right now? Is that our Chad M.? Chad's pack. There's a little something in here. You got a little speckle. Jaron Duran. Got to beat a high card of 124 to take them all, Chad. Let's see what you got. 16. Bunch of low card numbers. Ooh, there's a 128 and a 144 right there at the end. 144 is the highest card. That beats Matthew D. So Chad wins the pack war. Getting all the cards from both packs. Congrats. Duran's out of 299, by the way. And Chad, don't go anywhere because you got a mystery ball coming in hot. All right, Chad. Let's check it out. Yeah, I know this autograph. I had to think about it for a minute. Group chat, tell me who you think this is. Pretty recognizable signature. I believe I think I know who it is. I think Preston got it right. I think Fletcher, Griffin, Bubble Pug are all correct, I believe. Yes, Trey Turner. The lines. His autograph just looks like lines. It's like part of a math equation that needs to be filled in. So there you go. 
There you go, Chad. Trey Turner. He's a world champ, right? Correct. Correct Amundo. Thank you, Chad. Hope all is well with you, buddy. Uh, we got uh, Fabian dropping in on another jumbo pack. I'm going to separate the chrome at the top again like I did the last time. Just flip through the paper real fast for Fabian. Some nice prospects in this pack, on the paper at least. A little trout to boot. Not too shabby. The Chrome. You got Langoliers, Chisholm, Mitchell, Riley Green, Cody Hess, little Nico Horner, Matthew Lugo, and Marco Luciano. There you go, Fabian. Thanks again. Keep them coming if you want. I'll rip those Bowman Jumbo Packs all night. Travis H. with a Plinko drop. Styles with a couple Jumbo Packs. Travis, let's roll the dice for you. Fiverr to watch it. Variant number one. All right, Travis coming down the five spot in three, two, one. Ooh. And variant number one, we got the museum collection variant. Pack a museum with two bonus packs of Gypsy Queen. Let's see if anything's lingering in these Gypsy packs here. Nothing crazy in that one. Trout fortune teller. Check on the museum. Chipper, real muto. Torres, a little Vlad rookie, and the hit. Woo! Dual autograph. Yeah. Bob Gibson and Lou Brock. 15 out of 15. That's the first dual autograph I've seen from Museum. That's sick. sick. That's a great looking card, man. Look at that. Travis H., wherever you are. Congrats, man. That's a nasty card. Little Hall of Famers right there. Lou Brock, of course, former stolen base leader. Mm -hmm. Bob Gibson, one of the hardest throwers from the mound ever. And Mondragon loves it, of course. That's a great card. You should try to trade for this. That's a great card, man. I really like that card. Travis H. Cheers. Good stuff, man. Plinko board coming up for Travis H. All right, thank you, Travis. Now we got Styles taking a crack at a couple more jumbles. I'm going to separate the chromes again here. Just kind of cruise through the paper. Ooh, a little Dominguez on the paper. That's good. I'll put that right there for a second. A little 
Posey on the paper, Aquino paper, and a Rosarena as well. Not too bad on the paper in that pack. I'll sleeve a couple of those that I think you might be interested in. I'll sleeve the Dominguez, of course, and the Aquino as well for styles. Let's check out the Chrome in that pack. A little Wander Franco Chrome. Ashby, Kalanick, Paredes, Hernandez, Altuve. Ooh, a little screwball purple autograph out of 250. Muncie and Libertore in there as well. That was a good pack. And uh, i got to pause right there for a minute. I need to wash my hands. My hands just feeling a little bit less than optimal right now. So give me a second, folks. I'm just going to pause, wash, wash up real quick, and uh, come right back. All right, continuing with styles here. Still got some break spots available. Noir, uh, definitive, and uh, flawless break spots still available. If any of those sell out, uh, in the next 35 minutes, we will execute uh, those tonight. Three seconds for Bubble Pug. One, two, three. Nothing crazy on the paper there. Chrome, Christian Javier, Amaya, Hines, Pereira, Rutledge, Lusardo, and Alec Bohm. So that first pack was where it was at there, Styles. 
But thank you, of course, nonetheless. What's up, Justin J? You're off work. Congratulations, my man. Jump on into something if you want. I'd love to rip for you. Meanwhile, I'm going to do a little Plinko drop here for Eric B. Let's roll the dice. Dice comes up with a four. Drop it into spot number four, variant number one. Three, two, one. Ooh, on the left side, you got uh, Archive Sigs. Quick rip with a couple of Heritage bonus packs. Let's see what's in the Heritage. A little Cody there. Thank you, Eric B. Home run leaders, that's a cool card. Jordan Alvarez, rookie stars. It's actually a cool card right there with a Quino on it as well. Now let's check out your quick rip. Do not blink in three, two, one. Dylan Cousins, 77 of 99, Phillies. Herman says, hit that like button. Do it, do it now. Everybody hit that like button right now for our friend Herman from Norway. I'll even do it over here on my end too. Look at this, boom. Thanks Herman. And thanks to Eric B for letting us take a drop on the Plinko board for you. Stephen H and Fabian. And we got a quick pack war, Chad versus Carlos. Chad's pack first, high card takes all. Quino paper in there, high card for Chad. It's going to be... Looks like 125 there on Garcia. 125 is Chad's high card. Carlos. Oh, Rutschman on the paper. Got to beat 125 to win. No, high card is 84, I believe, there. 84 is not doing it for Carlos, which makes Chad M. the Pack War winner. Congrats, Chad. Stephen H. with a jumbo pack. Set the chromes to the side for a second. Flip through the paper. Seth Cold Beer sipping for anyone. Pino, a Rosa Reina are back to back in all these packs as well. It's also backed by Jordan, so that's not too bad there. A few nice rookies at the end of the paper. Now the Chrome for Steven. Hankins, India, Lewis, Whitley, Cabello, Alzale, 
Hernandez and Evan White. There you go, Stephen H. Thank you, sir. Another pack war, Kyle versus Matthew D. Start with Kyle's pack. Yeah, we gotta use a different pen. Try to find a pen that doesn't uh, that doesn't like leave as much ink if you can. I don't know. Maybe we should get some felt tip pens. <clears throat> Nothing crazy in this pack that I can see. Kyle's high card is going to be ooh, 150 is a good one. 150 on Luis Robert. Let's see what Matthew D can come up with. Gotta beat 150 to win, Matthew. Let's see what you got. High card is uh, 108. So that's not happening for Matthew. Makes Kyle S. Saxento the Pack War winner. Congrats. Fabian, followed by a prize wheel for Bill T. <laughs> All right, Fabian, here's your paper. Jason Dominguez paper in there for you. That's a good start. Wander Franco as well. And your Chrome. Rutschman. Marquez. Gray. Ruiz, Amaya, ooh, a little Evan White, Bowman Scouts, 10 out of 50, gold. That's nice. It's a really nice card. Followed by a little Jason Dominguez, spanning the globe insert. And a little Matt Manning. So nice pack there for Fabian. Bill T gets a prize wheel spin. Thank you to Fabian, by the way. Yeah, no doubt there, Saxento. No doubt. Mm, a little 2020 Bowman two-pack lot. Uh, what is that, a jumbo and a regular Yama? Get a jumbo and a regular pack there. There you go, Bill. Morahone, Brown, Matt Manning, Mountcastle. Got Julio Rod, Nick Allen, Story, and Baez. Jumbo pack for Bill. Put the uh, chrome in the back once again. Check out the paper. Starting out with a Luis Robert rookie. Another Luis Robert. Mountcastle. Franco. Aquino. Alvarez. Lux. Yamamoto, that was a pretty decent pack for the paper. 
and a chrome. Manoa, Pash, Wynn, Gonzalez, Sanchez, Robert, Trammell, and look at that, autograph, Ruben Cardenas, Refractor Auto out of 499. There you go, Bill. Hang on to your Bowman Prospects autos, folks. You never know who's going to be the next big thing. Could be next year. It could be two years, three years from now. You never know. Nice little spin on the prize wheel for Bill T. Thank you, Bill. That's all we got right now in the lineup, folks. Raffling tonight is the uh, Tops Update box and a couple of quick rips. That's on the raffle block tonight if you want to jump in and maybe try to get a part of that. Raffles are just bonuses, folks. <clears throat> Braden, thanks for the $1.99 super chat for to say you got some retail bowman today. Good for you, buddy. Good for you. But uh, buy hobby, people. Buy hobby. Support your hobby shops and buy hobby cards. Wherever your hobby shop is, make sure to support them as well. Braden supports us as well. Thank you, Braden. Last call, folks. Last call is what I'm going to call right now. We're going to hang out till 6 p.m. See if any of those other breaks might fill up. We'll give you guys about 20 more minutes to fill out any of those, uh, the, the definitive, the noir, the noir, or the flawless. If any one of those fill out tonight, we'll do that. But uh, last order will be at 6 p.m. Pacific tonight, folks. So consider jumping in. I'm going to drop a bunch of links like bombs right now. And we're going to leave you guys with a few minutes to see if any last-minute orders want to come through for this evening. Last call.
quick pack rip for Nick C here. A little 2020 tribute. 2020 tribute got out of hand fast. That product was super allocated and hard to get a hold of now, folks. Hard even for us to restock at a fair price. All right, Nick, you got Chipper Jones on the front, Jacob deGrom on the back, and J.D. Martinez, 42 out of 99 on the green parallel. Nice clean signature there for J.D. Martinez. There you go, Nick C. And yes, Shane K with a Plinko drop. Thanks to his wonderful lady. Variant number one. Let's roll the dice for you, Shane. Coming up with a three, so you're going to get dropped right down the middle. There's the chip. Here you go. Three, two, one. Beep. Ooh. Squeeze down the left side. You got the archive signatures. Quick rip with a couple bonus packs of heritage. What's up, Julia? Thanks for making it happen for Shane K. Appreciate your support of our family business. Little flashbacks. Frazier versus Ali. That's a cool card. I might even read the back of that. Fight of the century. Muhammad Ali was I'm going to read it down here. Felled in the 15th round against a battered and swollen Joe Frazier in a battle of undefeated heavyweight champs that truly lived up to the hype. Ali rose from the mat, but Frazier won in a unanimous decision. An estimated 300 million people watched via closed-circuit TV. That's cool. Show. Can I show that message? No. Ah, that's weird. I gotta figure out why that timed out. Yeah, I was looking at that right now too. We set up Nightbot. Larry Johnson, I did see your met your uh, chat message, and I appreciate it. We set up the Nightbot, and we gotta make some additional corrections with Nightbot. I believe it uh, wrongly did not show your message there, but thank you. I did see it. It's a nice Chrome Nick Senzel here. Maybe it was all caps, because it was all caps, possibly. I thought we had corrected that already, but we'll have to check that out later. Shane, let's check out your quick rip here. So do not blink in three, two, one. Nice, a one of one. First one of one of the night going to Shane K. And it's a Fulty autograph on a Bowman Platinum little checkerboard refractor there. One of one in the upper left corner there. I don't know if you can see that very well, but it's there. There you go. 2011 Bowman Platinum. That's a cool little buyback. Fulty. Shane's first 101, thanks to Julia. There you go. Give her a big kiss for us. And Matthew D. The Gypsy Queen box.
Start with your chrome pack here, Matthew. We got Dylan Cease, Astudio, and a little Will Smith. Blue parallel, chrome. 118 of 150. Nine more minutes to get your last orders in for this evening, folks. Nine minutes. Any orders that come in after 6 p.m. Pacific will be pushed over to tomorrow. That's right. We will be back for personals tomorrow evening at 4 p.m. Pacific. So be sure to join us then as well. I'm just going to be looking for obvious cards that stand out. Uh, obviously, uh, Matthew, when you get your cards in the mail, you can look a little bit more closely for any more short prints that we might have missed. There's a Gavin Lux rookie. I'm basically going to be looking for well, Jordan Alves, eh, fortune teller rookie there. I'm just going to be looking for stuff that stands out, autographs and anything else that might catch my eye. Another Jordan Alvarez rookie in there, base. There's a new sheriff in town. No, I'm a sheriff. <laughs> Little Robel Garcia on card rookie auto there. Hoping to find one more on-card auto in the box, but there's one. Uh, I think Carl Yastrzemski is a little veteran short print that I happen to see. Yes. Little backwards card behind Schwarber. Degrom, a little uh, Gypsy Queen logo swap parallel. Mike Trout, Tarot, it's a cool card. The Star, I like how they named him The Star. The yellow makes it pop. Yeah, the yellow does make it pop. I love the backs of these cards. Rogers blue Yeah, but can you throw me another pack of penny sleeves regular please?
The baseball card market, Herman, is uh, similar to any other major market in the world. It's all price and value is based on supply and demand. So at a time like now when uh, demand is super high for baseball cards, but especially the older products, 2019 and earlier, start to diminish, the prices of the remaining products start to go up all across the market. And when you take into consideration, obviously, somewhat smaller businesses like ours, uh, might be a little bit extra of a premium because smaller businesses have a tougher time getting product allocations and whatnot, but Matthew D. does not have a tough time getting a sick on-card rookie autograph of yeah. Bo Bichette as his last auto in the box. That's sick right there. Way to, way to come up tough right there for Gypsy Queen, Matthew D. Boom. Beautiful. And he's still got nine packs left in the box. Look at that picture of Astudio. I just think it's kind of a funny shot. Not the most flattering. Little no name plate, Stanton. Of the bazooka backs that I've found lately, uh, they're usually easily indicated. Either they're turned backwards or they look or feel different. So it's usually has been easy to spot. If I missed any, those will be left for Matthew D to find at his leisure. There's another uh, Gypsy Queen logo swap, Paxton. Two minutes to get your last orders in for the night, folks. Two minutes. Anything after 6 p.m. will be first up on Saturday. Bichette, base rookie in there. Brennan McKay. Last pack in the box for Matthew D. Arenado, Chang, Peralta, Kikuchi, a little Harper, Guzman, and Collins right there. But pretty decent box, including a Bo Bichette on-card rookie auto. Thanks, Matthew D. Hope you're happy with that. I would be. Fletcher with a couple of packs of Optic and our boy Dan N. with some Leaf Metal Draft. Looking like that's going to end it for tonight, and then we'll raffle after this. All right, Fletch, let's see what's up with a couple of Optic Hobby basketball packs. Got some red in here. Schroeder. Kobe White, rated rookie, Ben Simmons, and your red, Kevin Durant, all-star. Mm, 72 out of 99, I believe it says. It's a nice card.
Keldon Johnson, rated rookie. Miles Bridges on the back. You got J.J. Redick, Rainmakers, and... Ooh, autograph? Cam Reddish. Rookie Dominator Signatures. Cam Reddish right there. Look at that. Two packs, and you busted an autograph. And a nice KD red parallel. Can't be, uh, can't be mad about that, can you? Out of 99 on the Reddish Auto. There you go, Fletch. Cheers, buddy. And last rip of the night going to Dan N. Then we're going to raffle. Thank you, Dan. Happy weekend to you. Happy Friday. Let's see what's up with this Leaf Metal Draft. All right. Top card is Nolan Gorman on a silver wave. On card auto, numbered 7 out of 30. TGIF, Dan. TGIF indeed. It's a nice uh, start there to the box. Let's see what else is lingering. Next card down is Michael Toglia. A little 90s leaf uh, throwback on the silver. 25 of 50. And no, these cards are not made out of metal. But they are nice. They definitely look like they could be. Here's J.J. Blade on a little blue burst. As I'm now calling it. Blade was a good day. 28 out of 30. Logan Davidson on the 90 purple. 15 out of 25. That's a, that's a key word I should put in. Yeah. This next card is pretty cool. Speaking of purple, how about Brady McConnell on a purple wave burst, which I'm calling it. I'm not sure the technical name, but... Eight out of 15. Wow. <laughs> Your last card is a redemption. Your last card's a redemption, Dan, but I think it's one you might enjoy seeing. Last card of the night for personals, uh, folks. Check this out. 2019 Leaf Metal Draft Baseball, Jason Dominguez, base oh, auto. Oh. Parallels may be awarded at time of fulfillment. <laughs> Jason Dominguez autograph. Possible chance for getting a parallel. Leaf could stick a parallel with you as well. Bingo, says George. I love that word. Bingo. Yeah. Danny N. There you go, bud. Coming up huge on the Leaf medal right there. Leaf, uh, as far as I've heard, is usually pretty quick with their redemptions. So, but I'm not sure with, uh, you know, distancing and whatnot. I'm not sure what everyone's doing with redemptions right now. But Dan says, wow, always pulling the fire, sir. Thank you. Thank you, Dan. Great last rip of the night, buddy. Appreciate that thought right there as well. Cheers to you, my man. Let me know when you get this card back. We'd love to see a picture of it. That wraps up personal breaks for this evening, folks. But be sure to uh, join us tomorrow night at 4 p.m. Pacific as well for more. And we'll see what we can get into. Maybe uh, any of those other Breaks will sell out, and we can do one of those breaks tomorrow night. So consider jumping into the Flawless, the Definitive, or the Noir Basketball break. And the Select Case break will probably happen on Tuesday afternoon, so look for that. That's our next available time. Let's raffle. Give me a moment to set up the raffle, folks.
All right. It's all ready to go. Follow me, follow me, follow me to the randomizer screen. All right, everybody who jumped in tonight got a raffle spot for every 50 bucks you spent on personal break items. We're going to go... Spot one is going to get the archives retired. Spot two is going to get the archives active. Spot three is going to get the jumbo box. By the way, those jumbo boxes are going for between $250 and $300 these days. So let's roll the dice one time. Dice comes up with lucky number seven. Soup says, I'm so glad it's not a nine. Me too, buddy. Me too. <laughs> Seven times here, folks. One. Two. Three. Four. Five. Six. And here comes the seventh and final roll. Thank you and good luck, everybody. Seven. Boom. Look at that. George M. coming up two times. He wins both the quick rips. Larry K. with the jumbo box. And the randomizer has spoken. There it is. The stickers are on. Thanks, everybody. Quick shout out to Justin B for five bucks. The last super chat of the evening. Last box you guys sent me had another show. Hey, Otto. Thanks again. Well, that's awesome, man. Cheers to that. Thanks for the uh, tip hat love. Thanks to everybody in the group chat, especially our moderators. Soup, Fletcher, Styles was here. Mondragon, I believe that's it for tonight. Thanks to the Nightbot as well. Uh, thanks to the Yama 3000 for processing all of your guys' orders. And uh, thanks to everybody who jumped in and supported our business tonight by actually purchasing, purchasing products for, for personal breaks. And thanks for letting us rip for you guys tonight. We appreciate it. A lot of fun as always. Enjoy the rest of your Friday evening. And hope to see you guys all back here tomorrow at 4 p.m. Pacific for, for some more personal breaks. Have a good night, everybody. Peace.